suffered it all. He suffered it all because he loved me. Yeah. Because he loved me, my Savior died. All the cross was crucified. No greater love by mortal man has ever been known. This man.
congregation. Thankful most of all for His Holy Spirit. Thankful that He saved me about five years ago. And uh, thankful for a good pastor at this church. Amen. 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 That has good leadership. Amen. Amen. Some churches you walk in and they're still and they're cold and it's politics. Amen. Amen. It's worse than Washington, D.C. Come on. But you've got a pastor here that loves you. He loves the Lord. He wants to see the best thing for you. You need to cherish that. Amen. 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 It's good. We've got a pastor like that at home, and he preached a sermon Wednesday night. Are you sober? And I'm not talking about are you drunk or are you high. I hope nobody in the church is that way. Amen. If you are, there's an altar here. Come on. Amen. But are you sober in your spirit? Yeah. Are you impaired with the things of the world, or are you sober in your spirit? Are you walking around letting the things, the cares of this life, burden you down, weigh you down? Come on. And then when you encounter someone that's lost, you can't witness to them. You're impaired. I hope that you're sober here this morning. And I hope you know that you know where you're going. Amen. I hope you know you're going to heaven one day. If you don't, you can meet him here this morning. Amen. Amen. There's only Amen. one thing that matters, and it's if you've been born again. Amen. Amen. Thank you. 
section. Isaac came out and they popped him on the high end like they do all babies. I didn't hear him scream. Looked at the doctor and said, what's the problem? And they said, well, he's not breathing and he doesn't have a heartbeat. You, only, you may only have a few minutes. <coughs> and in the stillness of that moment, it's as if God spoke to me and he said, you don't have your family or your friends to call on right now, but you know me now. Amen. 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 So we kneeled down there in the operating room. My wife and I, well, she couldn't kneel. She was on the table, but I grabbed her hand. We began to pray. In just a few minutes, the best thing we've heard all day, Isaac began to scream and cry. He was the biggest baby in the NICU unit. And he fought tooth and nail, but he was, he was alive. Man. We're thankful. He pulled needles out of his head and his arm. He, he did not want to be in the hospital. He's still here with us today. We're thankful. Had God taken him, he'd still 
deserve all honor and glory. Amen. The Lord giveth and the Lord taketh away. But I say that to say this, there's power in prayer. Amen. And it doesn't matter what your need is, how big or how small, God wants to hear from His children. Listen to the words, what a prayer can do.
Yeah. Amen. 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 Savior. 
ביוב.